Hello everyone, welcome and welcome back to my channel, The Almost Organized Owl, where we are on a mission to get organized in our finances through budgeting, cash stuffing, and savings challenges. If that's something that interests you, please stick around. Today's video, we are going to be talking about my 2023 Big Happy Planner, and I am so excited um this is my first plant happy planner that i've ever had i've never had a happy planner before um in years past when i first started working i was working in uh, marketing and sales and the big planner that was out during that time was the franklin covey and i'm not sure if the if franklin covey is still um a popular planner I'm, i haven't been in the planner world for quite some time and um Franklin Covey was the it of all planners. It was the the one, the go-to planner. And so I remember having my very first Franklin Covey and just like, oh, this is so great. Um, and I utilized it quite frequently. Um, but then somehow along the years, I just kind of got away from using planners. I changed uh, careers and, um, you know, got married, did the whole thing and everything kind of turned digital. So up until this point, I've been using, you know, Google calendar to plan all events and, um, spreadsheets for, uh, our budgeting. There was a time, however, where I would just grab a notebook and I would just, you know, write down all of our expenses and I would subtract our expenses from our income. And that was the, the gist of our budget. And um, anything that was left over would just, you know, sit in our bank account until we use it on, you know, fast food or, you know, if we had under budget, under, under budgeted for uh, an expense, then it would just sit there for that. Now I am trying to be more proactive and I have categories and envelopes and um, a new happy planner and I'm so excited about it. Um, I was able to pick up this planner. Of course, it was on sale at um, Joanne Fabrics and they had a great sale going on on Black Friday and I was able to pick this up. Um, I don't know if I, wait, did I get this from Joanne Fabrics or did I get this from... Michaels. Oh no, this was Joanne Fabrics. Okay. Yeah, they had a great sale going on and I was able to get this planner. I think it was maybe about 40% off or something like that. So it was really great. And it says the future begins now. It's got this beautiful black and gold and marble. And um, all right, let's just open her up. And on the inside, you have this beautiful marbling. I'm definitely feeling the marbling, hence my marble table. Um, and here is just the different layouts. I have the horizontal layout. We'll see how it goes. I initially had the vertical layout with the three boxes. Um, and I kind of like that better because I can separate it a little bit more. But they didn't have this design in the vertical layout. Um, but Liz over at Liz and Less um, gave me a Etsy shop that I can print out different big happy planner layouts so i am super excited about that i am going to um, link the description link her etsy shop in the description box below if anybody needs to print out editable layouts of the big happy planner they also have the classic planner um printables as well and it's just for a few dollars to get the template and you can edit it and reuse it and reprint it as many times as you want. So I'm going to check that out. Thank you, Liz, again for that tip. Um, and this is just the intro page. This is the 2023 yearly calendar. You can put your 2023 goals here. And I think I'm going to um, start with that. And then 2024 goals in the 2024 calendar. Here is the perpetual calendar where I can pop in some key dates that we have for some events that we're going to have throughout the year. And then here are the January priority goals, important dates. And then over here are just some of the um, dates that are on the calendar. New Year's, MLK Day, and then January 22nd is the Lunar New Year. Okay, 
And this is actually a, a printout of the back page. I photocopied it uh, because I just thought it was so pretty and I wanted to use it as note pages throughout, um, but I have not hole punched it as of yet. I don't know if you can see it, it was slightly out of frame, my apologies, but this is what it looks like and this was just a photocopy of one of the pages that are, that's in the back. This divider here says trust the journey and this is for January. And this is the calendar that I'm going to probably use to put in our uh, bills that are due and the pay dates. I don't know if I'm going to use stickers or if I'm just going to write it in. Um, I've been watching a few YouTube videos of, with the stickers and they look so fun and colorful and exciting. But um, seems like they can get pretty expensive buying all those sticker sheets for each month. So I may just start off with um, writing it in and maybe add a few stickers along the way. Um, and then here is what I was talking about with the horizontal layout instead of the vertical layout that I found at the thrift store. Um, it was a Happy Planner insert set and it was for homeschool. And um, I thought this was so cute. So I just popped it in here as my little divider. And I found also some additional paper, um, Happy Planner, I guess, note pages. Um, at the thrift store also they were about two dollars and change for a good pack of paper and I thought that why not since I had this planner I'm going to show you that paper because I added it to the back of my January for notes this is the paper wild ideas how cute is this right only a couple bucks um, at the thrift store. So if you need some planner inserts or you want to just see if there are any um, Happy Planner type things, check out the thrift store because sometimes people donate those things and, um, you know, because they're not using them anymore or, or whatever. And you can pick up some planner things for pretty cheap at the thrift store. Just a little side note. Okay, so then... Um, that is the end of January. And then the February dashboard is stay humble and work hard. That's so pretty, isn't it? And then it's the same thing for each month. Um, March's dashboard says you are worth it all. Look at these beautiful colors. I mean, I don't know if, you, if they're coming across well on camera, but they are beautiful in person. And then for April, it's time to plan. And May, purpose fuels passion. That's nice. With challenge comes growth. And that beautiful marbling again. For July, it's just blank black marble with the gold and white accents. August. Great things can happen when you have the courage to be yourself. Michael Sam. And September is brave and beautiful. I love that for September. That's something that I will share with my children as they start to um, school in September. <laughs> All right. And October says future now. November says the idea of blooming is the idea of becoming something different. Alessandro Michel. And then finally, December is beauty in the everyday. And that is the end of the uh, planner, the calendar. And then, like I said before, here is the take note um, page, it, page that I copied. I thought it was so pretty to add to the other sections of the planner. And then it says, plan a happy life at the end. And these, whoop, I'm shaking the camera, my apologies. These dashboards or um, covers rather are changeable. So there we are. But I think I might keep this for a while um, and then just change the inserts of the planner. 
I am so excited to get started with this planner. Um, hopefully, I will be able to stick with it throughout the, the year. And um, you all will see me utilizing this to put in our budget items. I know it's not specifically a budget planner, but I wanted a planner that could encompass all things. Um, I didn't want you know, several different planners that I have to refer to throughout the year because the reality is that I probably won't. So <laughs> if everything could be encompassed in this one planner, um, that is great. And I plan to put in some um, budgeting inserts, some, uh, you know, track expense tracking pages and um, that sort of thing. Uh, I plan to add to this particular planner. Thank you all so much for watching. I thank you for um subscribing if you have already subscribed if you haven't please consider subscribing to my channel i truly appreciate it and give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and until next time bye